So be mindful about controllers. First thing is that the naming or the prefix of my controller is always singular. Afterwards, when I'm working on my method of my controller, the first thing I inject is the request class, which will be, once I have a test for this, a form request class. The second thing I inject is the model route binding layer, which potentially now is the project itself and afterwards will be my actual action. Afterwards, the only thing I do is call the action, which already contains validated information because this will be a form request. So here this will be create activity request. So this will contain already valid information. We know this. So I can literally use these methods to have the type safety of having an array here. So I'm going to just call action handle this project with this input. And finally, I'm going to return the response.